Schönen guten Abend und willkommen zurück bei The Devil in Me. Der Spiegel. Ja, äh, Mark, wo bist du? Mark. Oh, hi, Mark. Also, wir müssen zu Aaron zurück. Und die hat ihr Zimmer hier. Who is going around locking these doors? You met? Is a little helper in the yellow coat? Wait. What's that? Is this somebody's idea of a fucking joke? How is this here? Did you bring this? No. Is that her? Yeah. Shelby. Matching nails? God, don't. We always got them done the same. That's him. What? That's him. The guy in the back. You know him? He kind of did. He was just one of those guys that was always around. Movie at some of the same parties, but that's it. It was my fault. You know that's not true. The night it happened, I was supposed to meet her. We were going to grab some drinks, go to a party. I slept through. It was a big deal on campus not to go out on your own. Shelby waited for me when I didn't show, and that's when it, that's when he got her. It's okay. It's not fucking okay. It can't be. I have to live with it every day, and now someone knows. Someone wanted me to find this. What the hell is that? I have no idea. But I feel like it's bad. What the hell? Get over here, now! Charlie! Oh, God. I can't hold this. It's... You have to get the fuck out any way you can. Just get the fuck out now! Uh, Jamie! Charlie! What the hell just happened? I, I don't know, but I think it's really, really bad. Uh, it's okay. uh, it isn't moving. So now what? We're fucked. There has to be a way around. Yeah, maintenance corridors. Crawl space has to be. Suche nach den anderen. Wenn es mehr nicht ist. Äh, ja, danke, Ali. <lacht> uh. What's going on? What's going on? To Matt, what the hell is going on with him? He was nervous the whole way here. I chalked it up to him just being eccentric. There's a lot of miles between eccentric and murderous. Yeah, that's what's done. Also. Let's think about this. You saw Dumet take off. So maybe he found out there was a killer and bugged out? Maybe. Or perhaps the man we met wasn't actually Dumet. And the dude in the mask is? That contraption, that's a hell of a lot to set up. That was planned out, every bit of it. It was set up for us to find. Which makes it even more likely the dude on the ferry wasn't really the Met. Well, where was done? And where is Aaron? Mother fucker. What? Brick wall. Keep going. Just like Holmes. I know, I don't want to think about it. Tätzeit. Trying to map this in my head. But 
I think Erin's room has been completely cut off. Jesus, Charlie. Why is he messing with her? Because she's the most easily frightened, the most vulnerable. Don't you watch our show? That's what these sociopaths do. Oh, what the fuck? Is that a kid? Oh, good. You hear creepy kid voice, too. I was worried I was finally snapping. Where's it coming from? Charlie, come here. How's it get this open? We're in a bloody nesting doll. What? A Russian nesting doll. You know? A doll in a doll in a doll. Are you losing your shit? Because I don't need that right now. We're locked in a kitchen, trapped in a hotel, stranded on an island. Even if we get out of this room... How do we get out of the hotel? Exactly. Or off the island. Maybe we just focus on one thing at a time. This room first. Natalie Morello. Oh, are you... You think? Meet the last party that visited this hotel. You don't know that. Maybe it's... Fuck. You're probably right. Ja, wir haben vorher im Gästebuch unterschrieben eine Woche vor uns. Genau daran erinnern. Da haben wir auch den Brief von gelesen. Mit dem Matt hat die hier eingeladen. War diese Familie. Charlie, I found a way out maybe. Look. This one springs out. We can probably force it easier than the others. Stand back. That's not what I was expecting. Ah, Amy! Ah! Ah. Charlie? I know somebody was in there. I... I... can't... I can't breathe. Try to relax. Slow, deep breath. In and out. Ah, come on. They gotta hear this. Wait. Wait a minute. Guys? Hello? Hey! Charlie? Mark? Mark? Jamie? Come on, come on. Stop being such a damn wimp. Ja, 
Erin hat vor Betreten des geöffneten Raums ihren Inhalator benutzt, um sich zu beruhigen. Soll ja schon passieren. Treatment for what? Original Schlangenölsalbe aus bester Königskobra gewonnener Arznei, Silver Ash Institute. Silver Ash Institute. Schon geil irgendwie. Bestimmt sogar echt, äh, echte präparierte Leichen. Aaron hat beim Durchsuchen des Silver Ash Institute Beweise dafür gefunden, dass Charlie an den Morden mitschuldig war. Charlie. Na, warum sollte er sein Team tot wollen? Well, fuck you, Jamie. Blaue, wer ist die Süße auf dem Foto, das du hochgeladen hast? Sie ist ja total dein Typ. Du bist echt vorhersehbar. Wer? Aaron? Bitte. Mein Typ ist eine knallharte Powerfrau und keine scheue Waldkreatur. Sie ist scheu? Sie ist ahnungslos. Sie läuft immer mit einem verlorenen und verwirrten, Gesicht, äh, verwirrten Ausdruck im Gesicht herum. Dear Mr. Thompson, why don't you leave me the hell alone? Sehr geehrte Miss Monday, ich versuche bereits seit einigen Wochen, Sie telefonisch zu erreichen. Es geht um Ihren Sohn Hector. Er hat andere Kinder häufig in aggressiver und bedrohlicher Weise angegriffen. Diese Woche bemerkte sein Lehrer während des, äh, während des Sportunterrichts mehrere schlimme Blutergüsse auf seinem Bein. Sein Wohlergehen bereitet uns große Sorgen. Bitte kontaktieren Sie mich unverzüglich, um die Situation zu besprechen. Mit freundlichen Grüßen, Glenn Thompson, Direktor. <laughs> A whole carton this time. You trying to get on my good side or something? Yeah, well, uh, I think I'll save them. What, no questions? What's going on with you, Monday? Oh, you seem different. Ah, <laughs> I 
I see that glimmer in your eye, you little devil. I can keep secrets, man. We all have them. That prosecutor is trying to get numbers out of me. You know that? Of course you know that. Numbers. They got homes for 27. But we know he was closer to 200, right? Can you imagine that? I wish I'd had the time to try and beat that. Sure, they know about those nice realtor ladies. They got families, after all. But the numbers the DA is asking me about? I think he knows there's some people out there, rejects, misfits, the kind of people that when you see them coming, you look the other way. Does anyone notice if they go missing? My father always told me to leave my mark on the world. I never knew what he meant by that. Not until I watched that first girl bleed out. I call it art. That's my signature on society. It's not murder. It's an aesthetic response to what this world has made me. Ask people to list serial killers, and they'll drop five, ten on you before they can think of any more. Ask them to name the detectives that caught those killers. No one is going to say a damn thing. No one knows. No one cares. No one makes movies about them. No one puts their faces on t-shirts. No one gives a shit. <laughs> I've left my mark on the world. Have you? Okay, interessante Ansichten. Verband sie den Teufel Alkohol mit Dr. Holmes Wundermittel. Viel zu lange eine Vorliebe für Alkohol wurde lediglich als Charakterschwäche und Mangel an moralischer Faser stigmatisiert. Verblüffende Durchbrüche renommierter Mediziner haben jedoch gezeigt, dass Alkoholismus eine Krankheit ist wie Syphilis und Cholera und nur als solche erfolgreich behandelt werden kann. Aber obwohl Mittel gegen Alkoholismus verfügbar werden, hat die Gier ihrer Hersteller die meisten davon jenseits des Geldbeutels des gewöhnlichen Mannes platziert. Besonders wenn der gewöhnliche Mann durch sein unglückliches Leiden bereits an den Rand des Ruins getrieben wurde. Durch ein dringendes öffentliches Bedürfnis wurde nun von dem geschätzten Chicagoer Arzt Dr. Henry H. Holmes, der auf eigene Kosten das Silver Ash Institut gegründet hat, um den betrunkenen Massen erschwingliche Therapien anzubieten. Schon jetzt erzielt der gute Doktor bemerkenswerte Ergebnisse bei denjenigen, die durch die Türen seiner Klinik treten. Im Silver Ash Institute wird nicht auf Gebete, bitten an den Ermächtigen. Das einzige Gesetz ist die Achtung von Dr. Holmes und seinem Wundermittel, eine patentierte und dennoch sehr erschwingliche Mischung aus geheimen Inhaltsstoffen, darunter reinstes Silber aus den Minen von North Dakota. Bei dreimal täglicher Einnahme über einen Zeitraum von vier Wochen, und er sei dieses Heilmittel den Patienten von seinen früheren ungerechten Gelüsten befreien. In der Tat wird nach einer einmonatigen Behandlung im Silver Ash Institute unter den strengen Anweisungen von Dr. Holmes nur noch wenig von ihrem schlechten Alten selbst übrig sein, wenn sie abreisen. Silver Ash Institute. Ja, uralt sein. Aaron, hello? Jamie! Jamie? Aaron? You there? Uh... Hello? Can you hear me? What is happening? What? You're not safe, Baron. How are... You have to listen to me. Do exactly as I say. Jamie, what is going on? Where are you? I don't... Just listen. Hey. Listen. There's a cupboard in there. You have to get inside right now. What are you talking about? Just hide, Aaron. Why are you telling me this? What's happening? Aaron, now, just trust me, okay?
Ich mach die Taschenlampe aus. Und hör auf zu weinen. Aaron hat sich im Schrank versteckt, nachdem sie Jamie über das Mikrofon gebracht hat. Charlie? Jamie? Hello? Where the hell are they? Hopefully somewhere safe, wondering where the hell we are. Okay, check this out. What is going on? Are, are we locked in here? Uh, no. Looks like it, yeah. Wait. Shh. What? Shh. You hear that? Is that them? Where is it coming from? Somebody's in the restaurant. What's the plan, Charlie? You end up dead. I'm going to toast all of you. I know that I'm the butt of your jokes, and that's just my cross to bear as the patriarch of our little family. Mark and Jamie, the two of you do the work of a team of ten. And Kate, despite our bickering, you are the heart of this show. You keep people interested. What the fuck is this? What are you doing? Just stay back from it. Relax. So, it's a bunch of mannequins dressed like us. Weird? Yes. Cause to lose your shit? No. Also, die Schaufensterpuppen. Okay, this is fucked up. What the hell is going on? Warum die keine Haare? Jesus. It looks just like him. No way somebody just threw these together in the last couple of hours. You hear that? Footsteps. And they're getting closer. Jamie, thank God. I'm so glad to see you guys. We have to get the hell out of here. Oh my God. When that wall shut, I... I'm just glad you're okay. Demet killed his groundskeeper. What? What? Right in front of us. Ach ja, stimmt. Demet? It's a setup. He was wearing a mask and I know... Jamie erzählte Kate und Mark, dass Dumet den Hausmeister getötet hat. How that sounds, but I'm not joking, and now he's after Aaron, so we need to move. Wait, hang on. Where's Charlie? I don't know. We got separated. No way this is happening. You know, so when our bodies wash up on the other side of the 
Are you fucking kidding me? Bodies dead. Jesus, dead. shut Bodies. it up. Yeah. This, it's fake, a prop, or from an animal or something. It has to be. No, 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 no way. Oh, jetzt fass es doch nicht nur an. Oh, oh, it's real. It's fucking real. I told you this was all too much. Let's get out of here. What's going on? The door I came through is locked too. Two men! You wanna play around? Get out here. Right now. Let's fucking play! Charlie Keller, 23 Uhr 52. Uh. Heute ist weg. Das lag da doch. Alles klar, wir finden den Ausweg dann äh, in der nächsten Folge. Ich hoffe, ihr schaltet dann wieder ein. Ja, mein Name ist Tom und bis dann.